I know my nose is really red by the way, it's because it's really freezing. <laughs> Hello, so for today's video, this is going to be day six of the Tarte Beauty palette. So obviously, like I've said in the other videos, it is seven days of back-to-back -back Tarte Beauty palette because I feel like it's what it deserves. And yeah, the last day will be hair, makeup and outfit inspired. So, let's jump into it. So I've already got eyebrows and base on. Um, I was watching Raw Beauty Christie's video where she recreates her old makeup look. And I was watching it and I was like, oh, like that look would look really good with the Tarty palette because a lot of the shades that she was using from different palettes are all basically in this. So I want to give that a go today. So I will leave her video below so you can go check that out. Okay, so I've just stuck a bit of tape down because we're going to do quite a smoked out, winged out look. Um, so I'm going to start off by trying to open the palette. I don't know why I have such a hard time opening palettes for. I'm just like always struggling. So I'm going to highlight the brow bone first and I'm going to take, you guessed it, Metallic Aura, which is this gorgeous shade here. I just, I want them to make this into a highlighter, like, so desperately. It's so beautiful. I'm just going to take that on a smuggler. Oh, get me words out today. Crown Rush C510. I'm just going to put that underneath the brow bone. Okay, so now I'm going to start off by taking Matsu which is this shade down here. And I'm gonna take that on a Spectrum B06. And we're just gonna take that through the crease. I'm taking it out to the tape as well. Taking it out and it's like out of the. Just really striking that out. Just gonna further blend that out with the crumb brush. Make sure everything's nice and blended. Then on a Crown Brush C528, I'm gonna take Matte Ritual, which is this shade here. And we're just gonna deepen this up. So I'm just gonna take that through the crease. Oh, these are super, super pigmented by the way. So if you don't want a lot, really tap off the excess. And take that Crown Brush just to really blend it out. I'm going to do the out of the mix it with Ritual and Soothe. Like so, and just blend that out. And then, I don't know, I'm going to take such a small brush um, because I want lots of precision with this shade because Memory Matte is super pigmented. So be careful when you're using this. Like, I'm telling you, like, it's like a black eyeliner. Like, it's super intense. So I'm just going to start off with a little brush. And just really smoke it out so concentrating that on like the V area I'm gonna do a bit of this action first I know it looks a bit strange so I'm just gonna take the crown brush C431 and just really blend that room just taking more of that black shade and just really blending it out again just gonna blend that out with the Spectrum B06 I'm gonna take a bit more of Soothe and just run that through so now we're going to cut the crease. So I'm going to take the Revolution Conceal and Hydrate Concealer in C1. And I'm going to take it on a Peaches and Cream PC51 brush. What I like to do is, it's not going to be a full cut crease. It's going to be basically half. So what I like to do is, I just like to place a little bit down. Look up. Look up. And then where that line is, is we're going to cut the crease too. Then for lid colour, I'm going to take Metallic Aura again, just this shade. And I'm just going to pack that on when we cut the crease. Now I'm just going to take the little bitty crown brush and just buff that through. So I'm just pulling the colour over, pulling the colour in. really want to make sure it's nice and blended. So, I'm going to deepen up the black a little bit, but I'm actually going to take Sequin Memory. Um, so, I haven't tried this yet, and it just looks super, super pretty. So, I'm going to take that on the Crown Brush C528. Just going to blend that out with the Crown Brush. Obviously, we might lose a bit of the glitter, but that's okay. I'm just going to take that into my colour switch, just to get off the product so we can blend take the crown brush so this is the duo fiber blending brush just buff that 
broken. So obviously I took the tape off and just cleaned it up. I think it's even. I'm going to smoke quite hard underneath the lower lash line as well. So that will all blend in together. But I'm going to take Aura Glitter, which is in this shade here. Obviously if you don't want to use the glitters, don't. Um, they're super beautiful, easy to use. Um, obviously you can take your finger or you can take a brush. So I'm going to take it on the brush. So this is the Spectrum A16. I'm just going to pack it on top of that metallic aura shade. I'm literally just packing it on. I'm getting a better camera lid soon. Um, I just ordered it literally like yesterday. So I'm hoping it comes soon because this one's not the best. And uh, the white focus is doing my head in. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to finish off my face and then I'll be back to obviously finish up the lower lash line. I haven't even decided what lashes I'm going to wear. I usually share that with you now. Obviously I'm going to go ahead and put mascara and stuff on. Um, obviously I will let you know what lashes I wear but at the minute I probably don't know. It's probably going to be something like short and then wing that. Uh, just because obviously we have that look going on. So yeah, I'll be back. So the rest of my face is on. The lashes are unicorn lashes in cherry tops so they were sent to me from we love lashes and yeah i've said these are my favorite before they're amazing they're great they just go with everything so we're gonna go back into sequin uh memory on that same little um what's this real techniques um fine liner brush and we're just gonna add a little bit of black I'm going to try and stay on camera. It's super hard for me to do this on my lower lash line. Then we're just going to blend that out with the crown brush. Then I'm just going to take Sue and a tiny bit of Ritual. Um, obviously the matte ones. And just run that along the lower lash line as well. Then for inner corner highlight, I'm going to take actually matte. Um, matte. Oh, get me words out. Aura um, Sequin. And take that on the Spectrum A12 and just pop that on the inner corners. Okay, so this is the completed look. Yeah, I'm quite happy with how it turned out, to be honest. I'm I'm always been scared of using black, but yeah, I don't know, like just, just like how it turned out. Really sexy, sultry. Yeah, I love it. So, uh, obviously tomorrow will be the last video of Tarty Beauty Palette. And yeah, I'm just super super excited to finish off the final look and yeah so don't forget to subscribe all the makeup i'm wearing will be listed in the bottom bar along with the rest of the videos because obviously i can't really link five videos in the eye but yeah hopefully you enjoyed the video 